So, as you can see, I've managed to catch another copperhead. This is my second one now. Um, these are the only venomous mistakes I've ever caught, but this is my second one of catching one. Um, as you can see, he's about 18 to 24 inches. Well, probably about 18 to 22 inches, sorry. Um, it's hard for me to gauge 100% without actually measuring him, which I'm not going to do. But needless to say, he is an adult. And, uh, yeah. So this is the second one I've caught. I, uh, have got this thing now for catching them. It's, uh, it's actually just an old hoe that the blade broke off of. But I kept it because this is the perfect tool for holding them down on the ground and then grabbing them right behind the neck. So that's how I caught this one which I found right there underneath these boxes. As you can see, one of them is moved. I was actually uh, lifting these boxes up and putting concrete blocks underneath them so that they would be a little higher off the ground when I discovered him. Um, he actually wasn't too terribly hard. He was actually a little easier to catch than the first one. And maybe because I got better, or maybe because he was a little less rambunctious. But he did poop all over me as soon as I picked him up. So that's why he's got some little wet, wet, um, speckly white spots on him, because he pooped all over the place. And snake poop smells really bad, in case you, uh, you have noticed, or you had never been around snake poop before. So, but I'm washed up, so not a big, big deal. But, um, I'm going to take this guy down to a spot off of the, um, off the Trinity. There's a forested area, public land, it's a park. And uh, big, like, I like a park with slides and stuff, but like a nat natural park. Um, there's lots of copperheads down there. I've already seen them before, so I'm not introducing a copperhead to a spot where there were no copperheads. Um, and it's a good habitat for him. I think he'll be able to live out his days there, happy with other copperheads and not in my front yard. So um, hopefully this will be an uneventful trip. I would really hate for him to escape in my car while I was transporting him. That would be... Like the worst thing ever um, but this is the second time I've done it so the first one didn't escape during the transit so hopefully the second one won't either and uh, I'll pick up uh, the video once I get to the park and uh, I've released them so good luck to me I guess <laughs>